very young and somebody that uh, our scouts feel uh, is, a, is a breakout candidate, uh, you know, moving forward into uh, 2012. I'm Tim McMaster with the MLB.com FastCast, and that was Royals Senior Vice President of Baseball Operations and General Manager Dayton Moore discussing newly acquired starter Jonathan Sanchez. The Royals sent outfielder Melky Cabrera to the Giants in exchange for Sanchez and a prospect. Sanchez had a disappointing 2011 campaign, winning just four games, but he was 13-9 with a 3.07 ERA during San Francisco's championship 2010 season. In his one season in Kansas City, Cabrera set career highs with a 305 average, 18 homers, and 87 RBI. We weren't exactly sure that a player like this would be available. We did put Sanchez's name out at the end of the season, and um, this became the best match for us. I think he's a solid number three starter on a championship type club. He certainly has performed like that in the past. As you know, he's thrown an open during the major leagues. And again, when you look at this guy's strikeout rate, uh, his swing and miss uh, ability, it's amongst the very best in the game. The Twins have decided to part ways with general manager Bill Smith. Smith has been a member of the organization since 1986 and took the reins as GM in 2007. The team won division titles in 2009 and 2010, but had the worst record in the American League in 2011. Terry Ryan will take over as interim general manager. Ryan was GM from 1994 to 2007, a stretch in which the team won four division crowns. Since 07, Ryan has worked as senior advisor to the general manager. This is going to be a challenge. I'm up to the challenge. I appreciate the opportunity. I hope Billy considers coming back in a job description that Dave and, and myself and Jim have laid out. The Orioles will introduce Dan Duquette as their new general manager at a press conference on Tuesday morning. Duquette was the Red Sox GM from 1994 to 2002, acquiring much of the talent that went on to win the 2004 World Series. Former Orioles Vice President of Baseball Operations and current MLB.com analyst Jim Duquette, who is also Dan's cousin, weighed in on the move. The fact that he's been out for a long period of time has, I think, drawn at least some questions, understandably so. but. He has a lot of skill sets that you look for in a general manager. He's obviously bright. He's put together winning organizations. And I think the interesting combination of, of him and Buck Showalter in Baltimore makes it, I think, a nice combination down there. For more on these stories and the rest of baseball's hot stove action, stay locked to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.